Hi, this is Tanner, Rissa, and Willa. We're accomplishing a lifelong dream of ours to live internationally, and we now call Germany our home. With so many new cultures, religions, landscapes, and foods to experience, we have been busy immersing ourselves to our new life abroad, one country at a time. In six short months, we have traveled to Iceland, Greece, and many other nearby countries. We've had tons of crazy experiences, like chasing a guy down who stole our backpack in Croatia and crying when we first laid our eyes on the Dolomites. We've explored picturesque fairy tale villages in the gorgeous Bavarian Alps. We've even found our new love for German bread. But one thing we hadn't done was explore northern Germany. That is, until now. Good morning, everyone. My name is Tanner. This is our story to tell. Thanks so much for being here today. We are exploring northern Germany for the first time. If you've seen a lot of our other videos, you know that we live in the state of Bavaria, which is in southern Germany, and this is our first trip, our first full day in northern Germany. We're really excited to show you, tell us a little bit of our first impressions. And honestly, first impressions are, it is incredible. Hamburg, one of the biggest cities in Germany is beautiful. And today, the sun came out after some morning clouds and it looks fantastic. Can't wait to show you what we've got in store today. I don't hear people saying Servus or hello <laughs> that way anymore, which I'm so used to. Um, and of course, that is a Southern Bavarian or uh, Southern Germany thing. As you can see, we're exploring Hamburg by bike, which we have already loved. This is our first time we've really taken our bikes into a city and we might not be going back. One of our first impressions is of course the water. It is new for us to be able to explore a city with so many bridges. In fact, Hamburg has more bridges within its city limits than any other city in the world. It's just so fun to be able to stroll around and always look to see water. This view right here is incredible. You can see so many people doing stand-up paddleboard. We've seen sailboats, all different kinds of boats. So this house behind us reminds us a ton of when we were in Savannah, Georgia, the colonial type feeling of houses. And I mean, it is incredible. We can only imagine that a lot of these houses are from very wealthy people. In fact, our host who has been helping us here in Hamburg told us that a lot of these houses were from very rich, wealthy merchants. Very interestingly enough, a lot of newer build and more modern type homes are just right next to it. So it's a fun to see the mix of the more colonial style and then more of the modern getting mixed. Like every place you travel to, there's exceptions for everything. But so far, when we compare northern Germany with southern Germany, we have yet to see a half-timbered house. And that's really shocking to us because there seem to be all over in southern Germany. It's fun to see what northern Germany has to bring and the appeal is different. The houses are different colors. We're seeing a lot more neutral colors here in northern Germany so far, which they are beautiful. So not that they're better or worse. Don't want to compare it that way. It's just different. Both equally amazing. Man, we don't feel like we're in Germany. We've got to say from everything we're used to in southern Germany, we are in a different country and it is exciting to explore. The so house region of Hamburg has been incredible this evening. We enjoyed gelato, shopping a little bit, enjoying watching the birds, and it seems just like a ton of people are out enjoying a beautiful evening here in Hamburg. And for us, the architecture has been really cool. Just seeing the differences between here and Munich per se as like a bigger city, it's been really, really cool and fun. 
Oh my gosh, we thought that we'd seen the best of Hamburg, but turns out we hadn't even touched it. So here we are, it's an early morning, it's like 7 a.m. We're gonna go into the miniature wonderland and we are completely blown away by these views. We cannot wait to come back out and explore all of the beautiful bridges, canals, and waterways of Hamburg. This is just, again, another instance where we're like, what the heck, Northern Germany and Southern Germany are so different. And we are loving it. When it comes to Northern Germany and Southern Germany, the food is so different. Of course, you're gonna find traditional German food throughout the whole state, but when it comes to specialties, you are not gonna find Fischbrötchen in Southern Germany, at least not this fresh and this amazing. If you're up in Northern Germany, be sure to make your way and taste your way through the city because there's a lot of fun specialties here. there you have it guys this has been our first impressions of northern germany although this has been our first city we know we have a lot more to explore it's still been fun to share kind of the things that we've seen different from bavaria and other parts of southern germany that we've been to yes we definitely want to make our way up to northern germany again there is so much we want to see we actually had planned to go up to the north sea but we were so tired from the drive up here that we just weren't willing to do that four hour drive again to go out further but we will make it there someday we can't wait to experiencing mud hiking and all of the other things that northern germany has to offer there's so much so just keep that in mind when watching our video is we don't let this is just one city and that it doesn't en encompass all of what northern germany is so comment below on what we should see the next time we come to northern germany and what your favorite things are about northern germany have we pointed out a lot of the differences or are there many that we are unaware of let us know one last thing that we have to just point out is that German playgrounds are the best. We are at this one here this morning at Planten und Blumen and Willa has loved it so far. We came here last night yes. and all she could say was swing, swing, slide, slide. So we're enjoying a very quiet Sunday morning here where virtually no one else is here mm -hmm. and it's awesome. So thanks again guys. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you next time.